Hey, this is Chris with Affiliate Tube, and today I'm going to be doing a Meet VO review for you guys. Now, this product is huge for people who want to do webinars and online meetings, or even auto webinars, evergreen webinars. It's kind of like an all in one platform that can do any of these uh, and build your email list and send out emails, reminders, notifications. Um, a great tool, and what I'm going to do in this video is give you a complete Meet VO demo. I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna set up a campaign so you can see exactly how it works and go over a lot of the features included. Now, I'm not gonna go over every single detail and feature and option in this tool because there are a lot. So I'm gonna put some links under this video where it'll take you to my website and you can learn more about the product, you can learn more about the pricing, the upsells, and even some really, really nice bonuses you can pick up if you buy Meet VO through the link on my website. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into it. This is the Meet VO dashboard. You can see I've already set up four uh, small uh, webinars here. And what we're gonna do, I'm not gonna go through these right now, but over here on the left-hand side, you're gonna see where you can view all of your events. So here's all four of the ones that I set up. You can see here where I can start the auto webinar, auto webinar. This one here was not an auto webinar, and this one was. So you have different options here after you set your meetings up where you can go back in you can watch and replay them and so on uh, you can record them and here's your meetings your live webinars and your auto webinars so you can sort them by these links now there's also a calendar and the calendar shows you when you have all these webinars scheduled for and let's go back and you also have uh, your contacts and your contacts whoops your contacts here are basically everyone who opts in to register for your webinar and it saves them within MeetVO, but you can also integrate with third-party autoresponders and it'll automatically add them to your autoresponder whichever one you're using okay so what i'm going to do in this is i'm going to go ahead and set up a new webinar and i want this to be like an auto webinar something that continually plays over and over and over again that i don't have to come back in and check or do anything with so we're gonna go up here and click on new webinar and you can see my um, the one that I that I'm set up for here is just a max of five people for a meeting So but these are going to be different when you purchase you have options to purchase like unlimited and all that kind of stuff So just don't pay attention to that uh, We're gonna do new webinar And this one's going to be an auto webinar now when you go here the whole setup process is uh, pretty much similar you're going to see this page so whether you choose meeting live webinar or auto webinar most of the settings are going to be the same so the first thing we're going to do is give it a title so what I want this to be is say an auto webinar of my upcoming product launch of WP affiliate suite so I'm going to type in WP affiliate suite and then the source video so you can add a video from like YouTube or Vimeo in here I would recommend using Vimeo because if not on YouTube when it plays a video um, what it will do is it, it shows the YouTube link up at the top um, which is good in a way because they can subscribe to your YouTube channel but if they click on that link it's going to take them out of the webinar to YouTube uh, so it just depends on what you want to do and you can hide the replay controls too uh, or you can choose a webinar if you've already previously done one it's been recorded you can select it from here but what I want to do is go ahead and just copy this short video that I made and we're going to paste it in here and then we can choose when it wants to when we want it to play okay so if I wanted to play every single day um, every 30 minutes I can do that and so basically what I can do is create a landing page and say hey um, you know come check out this product watch this webinar it goes live in 30 minutes or it goes live in the next 30 minutes or whatever and so it doesn't matter because every 30 minutes that webinar is going to auto play and if they enter their email and their name they're going to get a notification of this webinar and they're going to be reminded of this webinar when it's coming up and then they're going to be sent to it so they can watch it and hopefully end up purchasing whatever it is that you're trying to sell or promote okay so in this example let's just say it is almost nine o'clock a.m in the morning so we'll just set this one say 9 30 run 9 30 every morning and then if i wanted to select all these i could I actually wish they had a button here for select all you just tick it and mark everything uh, but that's okay we'll just uh, do these ones here then you can down select your user time zone this is important be sure to choose this your date format i like to do the month day year you can send notifications here uh, remind them about the upcoming uh, webinar and down here are the reminder emails you can come in here and you can edit them or you can add new reminders 
and so you simply come in here click edit be sure to change this because they have it set up right now where it says uh, the meet vo team and meetvo.com so make sure you change that and you can change and edit your registration page so everything is right here it's easily uh, laid out for you to just select what you want and once you do this a couple times you can fly through it have a webinar set up in just a couple minutes um, so we'll go ahead and choose page details so this here is going to be the registration page we have full control over it you got a title here WP affiliate suite you can't really see it because it's dark so we'll go down here and change the color scheme and we'll change it to white so now we can see it and then you can add a short description I'm not going to do all that right now but you can change the text color to white you can add content on the page you can choose a, a promo video so if you want a video put here on the registration page you can do that down here you can collect a lot more information you can collect uh, their phone number address and and all this too and then you can uh, you got more options for the color schemes of the opt-in form for the chat settings you can decide if you want to include the full chat if you don't want to have a chat at all and then a thank you message uh, for registering to the webinar and a thank you video if you want to add that if you've integrated your auto responders through a third-party company like get response contact whatever all those other ones are you can select it here if you have it set up and then you want to click save and preview and then it's going to take you back to this page because you're all set up you're going to scroll at the bottom and click create event okay now once your event is created it's going to show up here you can see uh, the WP affiliate suite one and we can come down here and click on more and what it's going to do is it's going to give me a link right here now this link I want to copy and this is the link that I'm going to use for the registration page I'm going to open up a new incognito window paste this link in it and you're going to see now this is the registration page um, who's hosting it you select the date when you want to watch it here's all the times that we selected and then down here they can enter their first name and their email claim their spot it's going to send them an email instantly letting them know that they've registered and they've signed up for this and then depending on the follow-up notifications and emails that you sent they can get those as well just to remind them that the webinar is coming up and to go watch it okay I almost forgot but I want to take you in and show you what the webinar looks like too so here I am on the calendar I'm going to go back down to my event click on more and what I'm going to do is open up this link and this video auto plays so I can I can pause it if I have the controls enabled to pause it uh, but the problem is like I was mentioning earlier if you use YouTube videos you got your link up here and if let's play it and you can see how they can click out and leave and go to your YouTube channel so if you don't want them to do that I recommend you upload to Vimeo also with the player controls if you enable them they can pause this video and play it and then when they do it brings up the YouTube videos list here so otherwise what you'd want to do is come back edit it and what you'd want to do is come down here and click hide replay controls that way the controls don't show up the other thing that I forgot to mention earlier was this um, option here for watch now and what this will do after they register and put in their uh, name and their email it'll give them the option to watch that video right then and there instead of having to wait for the time to start so that may be a good thing to integrate that way you know that they're already there they're already online and they can watch it this is meet view remember I want to put the link under this video where you can pick it up from my website and get some extra bonuses too if you happen to buy through there um, but check out the pricing on there because the pricing will probably be updated sometimes they change so that's why I put it all on my website so if I need to change it I can go back in and update it so you guys always have the most uh, current information and what's going on with it so but if you have questions leave them under this video and I'll try to get to them as soon as I can otherwise like and subscribe until the next time thanks guys I appreciate you watching my videos